Good morning, dear friends. Today, I want to share a powerful message about God's abundant blessings. He wants to give you a thousand times more. Too often, we limit our expectations to what we think is possible, but God, in His infinite love and power, desires to bless us beyond our wildest dreams. In Deuteronomy 1 to 11, Moses speaks a blessing over the Israelites, saying, May the Lord, the God of your ancestors, increase you a thousand times, and bless you as he has promised. This verse reminds us that God's blessings are not limited to addition, but multiplication. He wants to pour out his favor, increase, and abundance in every area of our lives. Consider the story of Job. Despite losing everything, Job remained faithful to God. In the end, God restored his fortunes and gave him twice as much as he had before Job 42. 10. Job's story teaches us that God's restoration and blessings are beyond measure. When we remain faithful, he can turn our losses into abundance. Friends, here are some practical steps to help you embrace God's promise of a thousand times more. 1. Expand your vision. Ephesians 3.20 tells us that God is able to do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine. Don't limit your prayers to what seems possible. Ask God for big dreams and trust that he can exceed your expectations. 2. Stay faithful in small things. Luke 16.10 says, Whoever can be trusted with very little can also be trusted with much. Be diligent and faithful in your current circumstances. God sees your faithfulness and will reward you with more. 3. Speak words of faith. Proverbs 18.21 reminds us, The tongue has the power of life and death. Speak blessings over your life. Declare that you are blessed, favored, and prosperous. Your words have the power to shape your future. 4. Trust God's timing. Ecclesiastes 3 to 1 says, There is a time for everything, and a season for every activity under the heavens. Trust that God's timing is perfect. He knows the best time to bring his blessings into your life. 5. Give generously. Luke 6.38 promises, Give, and it will be given to you. A good measure, pressed down, shaken together, and running over, will be poured into your lap. Be generous with your time, resources, and love. As you give, God will multiply it back to you. 6. Stay connected to God. John 15-5 says, I am the vine, you are the branches. If you remain in me, and I in you, you will bear much fruit. Stay rooted in your relationship with God through prayer, worship, and His Word. This connection is the source of all blessings. Friends, God's desire is to bless you a thousand times more than you can imagine. Don't limit His power with small thinking or doubts. Embrace His promises and live with the expectation of His abundant blessings. In 2 Corinthians 9-8, we are reminded, and God is able to bless you abundantly, so that in all things, at all times, having all that you need, you will abound in every good work. God's abundance is not just for our benefit, but so that we can be a blessing to others. So, dear friends, lift your vision higher, expect more, dream bigger, and trust that God's blessings are coming your way. He is a God of abundance and he wants to bless you a thousand times more. Blessings to you and your family.